Constantine is a 2005 movie directed by Francis Lawrence um, and it stars Keanu Reeves, uh, we've got Tilda Swinton, Shia LaBeouf, um, Rachel Weisz and actually a lot of other famous faces in there. It tells the story of John Constantine who is sort of a sardonic chain-smoking I guess anti-hero um, and Shia LaBeouf is his assistant and they sort of come across Rachel Weisz's character of Angela whose twin sister recently allegedly committed suicide and she's trying to find out the truth about what happened and it sort of ends up in a in a bid to save her soul so mm -hmm. so i looked up the director francis lawrence i knew nothing about him actually um and it turns out that he's directed pretty much just music videos before um, doing Constantine. So what I would say is that you can tell. Um, everything's a bit stylized, it's a bit cheesy, it's a bit edgy. I mean we are, this is a film from the early 2000s so I, that kind of goes without saying but um, I would say that actually that that was a good choice of director um, because something that I actually didn't know is that Constantine is a superhero and he's a comic book character. Um, I, forgive me if it's not DC because I I that I'm taking a guess there. Um, I saw something about it being connected to like the DC universe so if it's not sorry I don't keep up with that um, but yeah so who better to direct a comic book movie than someone that's worked in music videos really um, he also did like I Am Legend and oh Water for Elephants which is so like what worlds apart is all I'm saying. Like, very different movies. So, who's in the film? We've got Keanu Reeves, and he's playing Keanu Reeves, and Shia LaBeouf is playing Shia LaBeouf, and we have Rachel Wise. She's she's alright. Um, she's she's pretty good. Yes. Um, Tilda Swinton's... Everyone's kind of hamming it up a bit in this film, which for me is fine. I This film is a guilty pleasure of mine because I watched it, I guess, when I was like 12 or something. Um, maybe younger. So, yeah. But the real scenery chewer runs away with the show hands down is Peter Stormare who um, pops up at the end and I have to say his performance is a guilty pleasure of mine I'm not going to shit on it at all because um, I, I just there's something about it and whenever I think of Satan now I think of this performance and his dripping feet and I love it now yeah. This film is not, maybe I'm making it sound like it's kind of super schlocky and kind of entertaining and fun, but it's actually got quite a dark, depressing tone to it. Um, I, you know, there's a lot of suicide and deaths and eternal damnation talk, so, you know, don't go into it expecting it to be like a fun easy watch because it's actually kind of depressing but overall i really love the story with this one um it's not overly clever or complicated but it works and it's it is really fun and enjoyable and even with this sort of slight 2000s cheesiness 
I think that kind so, of I guess what I'm saying is I recommend Constantine. It's it's a fun it's not fun, but it, it is it's kind of it's kind of sad and depressing. But it's it's also fun. Just watch it. I recommend watching it. And if you like who doesn't like Keanu Reeves? In this day and age. Also, I heard that they are. Um, I, I just found this out while sort of briefly looking into the movie that this year, a few months ago, they announced um, that they're probably going to do like a sequel to it or a continuation, or it's going to be tied in maybe like a DC Dark Universe, oh god, um, TV series with Constantine in it. Um, and I think like last year Keanu Reeves said that he would be interesting in, in reprising the role so I guess um, yeah I, I mean I chose to just review this because I watched it like two days ago and it was fresh in my mind-ish um, but yeah it turns out that actually maybe there's a, a, it's gonna be some more Constantine coming out so I guess we have to wait and see what goes on with that, but yeah, it's kind of interesting. Um, thank you for watching my chaotic energy interview. What? Thank you for watching my review. <laughs> thank you for watching my review. Um, this is just a channel that is kind of for me. Um, because I've been wanting to do this for years and years and years. I have no idea how to do YouTube or editing for YouTube. So this is literally just recorded on my iPhone. Um, so sorry, but I appreciate anyone that has actually bothered to watch this and who is interested in Constantine, like, I don't know what's going on in your life that led you to click on a review with no views about Constantine from 2005 but um I hope you're having a nice day um and yes this is a beer it's Northern Monk um I can't remember the name of it it's a pale ale mm.